<clears throat> ladies, 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 ladies. We're tonight on the she or today on the she and today in the she we're to do our this is my second try recording this video. I tried to record it last night but it wouldn't go through. So this is my second attempt at recording this. So let's get into it. So the Denver Nuggets beat the Golden State Warriors 134, 131 in overtime by three points. The first quarter was looking good. 34 19. Second quarter was still looking good. Halftime we had a big lead. Throughout the third quarter we had a big lead by the but midway through the third and the fourth, the Nuggets made a run. Cause of, the only reason they were in this game was because of Barton and Beasley and Porter and Plumley. Plumley had 15 points, 14 rebounds. Porter had 18 and 10. Malik Beasley had 27. Barton had 31. Nicola 23, 8 and 12. They got so lucky those players showed up. We should have won this game. We had some, seven players in double figures. Uh, Draymond, 6, 8, and 8. Glenn Robinson, 17 points. Uh, Collie Stein, 10 points. Lee, 21 points. Burks, 25 points. Russell, 19 points. Spell, or, uh, Paul, 10 points. Pas Pascal, 16 points. But they still couldn't get it done. Steve Kerr in the fourth quarter. I was questioning that uh, decision. Not call timeouts. Up play. Give it to your best player for the win. I see you give it to Albert Burke. He's been good, but he's no D'Angelo Russell. And Angel Russell, that's who should have uh, took the game tank three to force another overtime, but it's whatever. The tank is still on for our team. It's just we couldn't rebound. It's just it's just we couldn't rebound the basketball. Every time they they missed, they'd still get their own rebounds. I'll see you until next time. I'm out a lot. See y'all.